Hello Sagittarius, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. Thank you so much for dropping in today. This is your October 2017, oops, mini tarot reading. Oh, and we have the sun card, so it looks like it's going to be joyful. I love that card. It means joy, bliss, bliss and ease. It means happy like a child. So Let's take a shuffle here and see what's coming up for you. Oh my goodness, I got cards this way, that way, every which way, but I guess it doesn't matter. Please remember this is a general reading, and if you'd like one just about you, please stop by my website at www.soulstarbliss.com. And as soon as you get your appointment made, I'll get to them as quickly as I can for you. Let's take a look here. Woohoo! Oh, I like these. These are looking good. Okay. It says there's change, major change for you. Things are going to change, and they're going to change rather quickly. The changes that are coming, the ones that are good, I feel they will not revert back. No one can take this from you. You've asked for it and change is here and you're going to claim it for yourself. It says victory also could be yours here. I have the star card, which means you're almost like you're being led. Come this way, do that. I know what I need to do. It's a feeling inside. It's almost as if someone's whispering in your ear. Pay attention because it says this is going to bring you victory. Chariot, one who achieves greatness, wheel of fortune, things are getting better and better and better. So those of you that have been working on stuff or seeing them happen, this is really good for you. Um, it says messages are going to be real important this month and also some choices you're going to have to make. Okay, we have the two of swords, which to me means I can't choose wrong. I can choose to go this way or I can choose to go that way. Now, if I choose to go this way and should have went that way, for instance, I still would get to. But choice number three is I'm too afraid to do anything, so I'm not going to make a choice. I can deal with this. No choice, no change. So use your experience, use the knowledge that you have. Make that choice and make it wisely for yourself. It says new beginnings are possible, even though things seem like they're just not the way you want them to be. You're stuck. You can't get moving. It says don't give your power away. Just take one step at a time. Maybe things have started slowly, but you asked for new beginnings. They're right before you. They're very close to you. Right in front of your face, actually, in a lot of, of a lot of for a lot of folks, <clears throat> says you're going to be hearing from someone from the past. Maybe you're going to be doing some work with someone that you used to. Maybe you're going to be seeing an old friend. But remember this. Maybe it's even a reminder that you know all work and no play is for a very dull person. Just remember that when someone shows up from the past, if they were great before, chances are they still are. If they weren't so good before, and they say they changed. Let them prove to you. Use your intuition a little bit, and it won't lead you wrong. It says worries never fix anything, never change anything. Those of you that are feeling alone and afraid and are waiting for something, you're going to have the strength to move forward and make the choices that you need to. Hmm. It says here you're going to have everything that you need. I have two threes, which to me is divine guidance. It's um, completion. So the changes you're making for the future, can you do everything perfect right away? Probably not. It'll be almost like an apprenticeship, fine-tuning and, and making it better and better and better. And don't worry about what other people are saying. Worry about what you think, about what you feel, about what's going on. This here, too, will continue to bring more things to you. And there's going to be reasons to celebrate. Some of you have had not something to celebrate in some time. Grab this for yourself. Claim it. It says, stand up for yourself. And this is a good thing. It says you're nobody's fool. You're not going to be a fool. And it says, too, that a lot of you are going to get exactly what you asked for. So open to receive it. And this is a good thing. It says there's going to be a lot of people around you this month, which is just fine. It doesn't matter what's gone. We can't fix that. We can't change that. We can accept and learn from it and be in the here and now. And I have the victory card for you yet again. So it says what you've asked for is already here on the way. Open to receive it. And then um, do the best you can. Continue the good work because there's new opportunities on the way for a lot of you, my Sagittarius friends. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. I will be getting that love and money reading out this month of October some way. <laughs> and uh, I just want to take a moment and thank you for dropping in. And Sagittarius, we'll see you again next month. Bye now.